From our Center for the Arts studio, this is your AU TV 20 Sports Break. I'm Ben Volker. Thanks for tuning in. Through the first two days at the Finley Spring Invite in Lexington, Kentucky, the Ashland University women's golf team sits at 13th out of the 18-team field. At the Invite, freshman Samantha Webb recorded her fourth eagle of the season, extending her record for most in the Ashland women's golf program's history, and is in 64th place after two days. Freshman Grace Grant leads the way for the Eagles in 41st place with two birdies, while senior Sophia Lowe is right behind in 45th place with three birdies. The Finley Spring Invite will conclude today. The Ashland University softball team split their doubleheader against number seven ranked Grand Valley State in the team's home opener on Monday. In game one, after falling behind early on an unearned run in the first inning, the Eagles quickly responded with three runs of their own in the bottom of the first two of which came off of a single from junior designated player Haley Struckman. The Eagles continued to add to their lead and took an 8-3 win in Game 1. In Game 2, Grand Valley State again took an early lead, but a two-run home run from junior outfielder Lauren McMillan tied the game at 2. Both teams again scored in the 6th, sending the game into extra innings. In extras, the Lakers rallied with three runs in the top of the 8th, and the Eagles failed to respond, handing Ashland a 6-3 loss. The Eagles next prepare to host Wayne State in a doubleheader on Thursday. In the NBA, the Cleveland Cavaliers fell to the Los Angeles Lakers by a score of 131 to 120 on Monday night. In his return to Cleveland, former Cavalier LeBron James took control of the game, scoring 38 points as part of a triple-double performance. Despite James's monster game, the Cavaliers led the Lakers by one point going into the fourth quarter. The Lakers, however, opened the fourth on a 12-2 run, and the Cavs could not recover. James is now 17-1 against the Cavaliers, and has averaged 29.6 points per game against his former team. With the loss, Cleveland falls to 41-31, and sits a game ahead of the Toronto Raptors for the sixth seed in the Eastern Conference. The Cavs will next head to Toronto for a major matchup against the Raptors on Wednesday night, as they try to remain outside of the play-in tournament seeding. That is it for this AUTV20 Sports Break. Be sure to follow us across social media at AUTV20. I'm Ben Volker. Thanks for watching.